guys. Today I'm going to be doing a Q&A video with my dog, Zar. This is Zar. C-Z-A-R, meaning emperor in Russian. Not a lot of people know his breed, but I do because we've had him for a while. He was born September 11th, 2016. He is a Mexican Exolo, also known as a Zolo, Sholo, Kutamilis or something. I, can't, I don't remember. Just... This breed of dog is very energetic uh, and also hypoallergenic, which means if you're allergic to dogs, there's a good chance this dog won't affect you. They don't shed at all. He is a male, unneutered. I've owned him since December 2016, December 2016. 23rd is when I got him. He's very handsome. Hang on. Yes, sir, come here. I'm gonna take a quick break. Sir, come here. He's very lovely, loving and he has separation anxiety, so I have to love him up. A good oiling every now and then makes his skin look really good and it feels good too. Yeah! Aww. I would switch the camera, but hang on. Here you are. He curls up and cuddles with me. He sleeps underneath my blankets. He sleeps uh, around my neck. He sleeps above my pillow. He, he sleeps everywhere. <laughs> he sleeps underneath my bed and everything. We have a pond over there and during the winter, he actually went up on the ice over the pond and he fell in because he's a moron, he was loose. And I, I freaked out and he got out, but well, imagine that, a hairless dog in the freezing cold water in the middle of January. Or was it February, either way. We have a 100 acre trail, so it's quite long. We can go right up to the windmills, to the barns, this is not exactly our, like we don't own this property, but we're allowed here. We talked to the owner. The owner is just somebody that comes here and plants corn and canola and stuff. Once or twice a year he comes. So all around we are allowed to come here as long as he's not spraying with his big tractor. I like to ride the horse down here. There's actually some hoof prints from last year. Uh, He's very fast. Oof. He's also very elegant and stuff, but he's still young. He could outrun a horse any day. Now, we don't want to go any further because it's cold. So we're going to turn around here. Come, Zar. His eyes are a light brown, or golden brown, I say. Come, Zar. He's gotta go poop, so I'm just gonna let him do his thing. Yeah, either way. It gets cold here during the winter, really cold in Canada. So he's more of an indoor dog. There he goes. He, when, when it's during the winter, we only let them outside a few times a day so they can go poo and pee. Otherwise, they don't want to go out. If they see snow, snowflakes, it's just a blur when they go outside, like they're in and out. And out and in or whatever. He likes walks during the summer. He can get hot during the summer which is why it's important to oil your dogs every now and then. You don't want to give them sunburns, but their dark skin color helps with sunburns. I can't run very fast because my legs are weak. 
due to lack of exercise. But I'll try and jog at least for him. It's me trying so hard. Hold on, Zar. This is where I like to hang out sometimes. They're also very good at jumping and such. What is it? What is it, Jar? I'm gonna show you how well you can jump. So we got some flowers there. Now there's like this brick thing here. You can jump right over. I don't even know if you guys saw that. Okay, Zara, come on. Oh, look, a ball. Zara so like balls. Yeah, it's yours now. What if I threw that ball, Zara? What would you do? It's mine now. All right, let's see where we can throw this and we'll try and chase after it. Nope, nope. He almost got it. Oh, so you get to the ball and you don't even want it. Fine. So, uh, you guys should comment more um, questions in the comments. I can like do another video on him. My next video will probably be on my dog, Chloe or on my horse, Daisy. That's it for now, I'm gonna head back in the house. He gets lots of exercise other than this.